they're not going to be so hard white because nothing's pure white in nature. Do the other horn. I got it all pretty much where I want it to be.
A lot of people are worried about using a, a larger needle, a 0.5 millimeter, because they're, they're afraid that uh, they're not going to be able to get real fine lines and details into their painting. And truthfully, if you have learned how to use your airbrush properly and uh, have gained very good finger control, you can make hairlines with a 0.5 millimeter needle and uh, thus eliminating a lot of the need for a micron. Uh, they're excellent. I love my micron C and my micron SB. However, it's not necessary for me to use them for fine detail, especially when you're doing t-shirts. Um, on fine artwork, on paper, on uh, hot press, illustration board, it's nice to have the ability to turn your pressure way down to 10, 15 PSI uh, and worth working on metals. But for t-shirt work, you can get really, really fine details out of a 0.5 millimeter needle. You can even do the same on a automotive piece. I've seen many of the artists use the HP BCS to do automotive work and still retain really nice, tight details. And that, my friends, is why you don't start your air pressure pointing at the t-shirt. It just spit off a little hair and some paint. Okay. And I think... We're just going to go in a little bit on the nose, lighten a few hairs in there, maybe a couple over here. Not many, just a few nice bright spots. <laughs> 